So when you're trying to figure out what God wants for you in your life, um, we call that discernment. And I would say that the there are two primary steps that, that are really important to take. Uh, the first one is to be at one with Jesus in as many ways as possible. So that means going to confession, um, going to Eucharist, praying in adoration, uh, reading scripture, seeing Christ and those around us, being at one with Jesus in as many ways as possible. There'll be a moment of peace or a moment of calm, especially in prayer or in uh, adoration or, or at mass. Jesus will always lead you by this feeling of peace and joy, even excitement. And so when we're discerning, one of the things that I like to do is enter into whatever it is I'm trying to figure out, the two different options. And if I'm if I'm at one with Jesus, I'll have it deep in my gut, this feeling of peace and joy that is way deep down inside. In terms of discerning the will of God, I would say that if more and more in your prayer, your mind is always going back, going back to the priesthood or going back to you know, the religious life, uh, that it might be a sign that God may be calling you. Now the, the spirit against Jesus, they call, they call it, uh, could be the devil, it could be the world, it could be our own uh, materialistic desires. When we're one with Jesus, that other spirit will lead us with this feeling of anxiety and fear. And it's just important to remember that Jesus will never lead us with that sense of fear or anxiety. And I think that's a really good way to figure out, is that feeling that I'm having coming from God or is it coming from somewhere else? God uses our desires, and so our, our, our desires shouldn't be discounted. It's been nothing but blessing on top of blessing ever since I decided four years ago, 2011, to go down this route in a seminary. It, it takes time. It takes a lot of patience that, uh, I, that you may not be willing to, 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 to feel in the moment. You know, you want an answer. You want an answer now. Uh, but God's timetable is a little bit different than ours, and for good reason. Uh, oftentimes we need to grow, and uh, we're not always ready to make the jump immediately. And so I would, I would just say that discern through prayer, uh, and especially I would recommend getting a spiritual director to help you discern w where your desires are coming from. You know, you may be feeling conflicting desires or some such thing, um, and so a spiritual director is always helpful.